This is Lady Lila Brown from LB Media Group's Melanated News You Can Use at City Hall's Tom Bradley Tower for more coverage of Los Angeles Mayor Karen Bass. The mayor is meeting with a delegation from Governor Newsom's administration led by Lourdes Castro Ramirez, the Secretary of Business, Consumer Services, and Housing Agency. Mayor Bass continues her work to bring to bear a whole of government approach to Los Angeles homelessness crisis following unanimous votes on her homelessness strategy from the Los Angeles City Council and County Board of Supervisors. And many of us know how that vote but went. But here we mean by the whole of government representatives from state housing and community development. And get this, the state housing finance agency, the state civil rights department, the LA County Home Homeless Initiative, the LA County Development Authority, Los Angeles Homeless Service Authority, and various city departments all in attendance. Recently, she signed an executive directive launching Inside Safe, which will assess street homelessness across Los Angeles. And then proactively engage with people living in tents and encampments based on which locations are most chronic and where people are most in crisis. The mayor continues to note the immediacy to begin to moving people living in encampments indoors. Once in Durham housing, social service agencies will provide wraparound care to each participant to transition those previously living in encampments into permanent housing, improve their well-being, and promote their stability. Such an effort will simultaneously enhance the safety and hygiene of our neighborhoods for all residents, businesses, and neighbors. Cabinet members have been directed to submit a report to the mayor's office on all items related to the Insight Safe Action Plan by March 31st, 2023, and so we'll be sure to follow up on that. This is Lady Lila Brown with another edition of Melanated News You Can Use from Ella B Media Groups reporting from City Hall. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our YouTube, Instagram, and various social media feeds as we continue to follow the mayor's plan to cure homelessness in the city of Los Angeles. Make sure you tune in, lbmediagroup.com. Thank you so much for tuning in. Until next time, take care and good luck. I want to first thank Secretary Castro Ramirez for joining us today and for leading this delegation from Governor Newsom's administration to come to Los Angeles. What Angelinos see here today is the way forward. City and state government working together every single day to bring unhoused people inside and to prevent families from falling into homelessness. A couple of days ago, Madam Secretary, LA could see the city and the county working together when I testified um, before the county about our state of emergency and supporting their resolution to um, look at the issue from an emergency perspective as well. Uh, the unity is not just to feel good, unifying the county and the state. This unity is not just to get along. This unity is about what is needed to address the problem. So my mission is to move Los Angeles forward and that requires a new, urgent, and strategic approach to addressing the homelessness crisis. I want Angelinos to know that we are hitting the ground running and that there will be no holding back in my administration. And I know that the same could be said for Secretary Castro and Maris as well. Because with more than 40,000 Angelinos unhoused today and five of them dying every day, this is an urgent humanitarian crisis and I will not stand by and allow for communities to suffer. That's why I started my first day in office, not at City Hall, but at the city's emergency operations center, where I declared an unprecedented state of emergency on homelessness. I issued an executive directive to dramatically accelerate and lower the cost of building affordable housing and temporary housing. And yesterday I issued an executive directive launching Inside Safe, Los Angeles' citywide proactive and housing-led strategy to bring people inside from tents and encampments for good and to prevent encampments from returning. I say all of this to make sure that everyone understands how seriously and urgently that we are beginning to act here in LA. I want to be clear that we are ready to lock arms with the state as we are with the city, as we are with the federal government, to accelerate and expand our efforts even more. The agencies under the overall banner of business, consumer services, and housing that are here today represent tremendous partnerships in our work. 
The county, the uh, State Department of Housing and Community Development plays a key role in a range of housing, as does the California Housing Finance Agency. The Interagency Council is a tremendous convener that recognizes, as I do, the power of partnership. And I'm pleased to see the California Civil Rights Department as part of this delegation, as we all know that Latinos and African Americans and others are disproportionately affected by the crisis of homelessness. It's my hope that together we can knock down barriers to deploying services and getting people housed, that we can put all of our resources, both state and local and county, into action with an urgency that has been missing for far too long, and that we can each dig deep to find more resources to tackle this emergency. Again, this is not a photo op, this is real work. Homelessness should not be approached based on jurisdictional lines. We must approach homelessness based on the best combination of resources that create solutions for people, whether those come from the city, the county, or the state. It's my hope that this spirit that guides our discussions here today and ushers in a new era of cooperation between the city of Los Angeles, the state of California, the county, and the federal government to bring people inside to save lives and to improve all of our communities. So thank you so much for being here, and I look forward to this tremendous partnership that I know that we will serve the people of Los Angeles and the state of California. Thank you very much, Madam Secretary. Thank you so much, uh, Mayor. Uh, thank you for the welcome. Uh, thank you for 